Spice Road, and there are trucks that are known to drive this. Here comes a truck now. Here come two trucks, actually. We pulled over. I don't really have the courage to, uh, to try to two-lane it with these guys. Yeah, I think they respect that, too. Oh, he waved. That was nice. I imagine they get tired of tourists like us driving up and down this thing. But... Oh, he waved, too. Look at that. This has been my favorite part of the drive since we came out of the pass. We've just been, uh... It's been an awful road. Well, not the worst, but it's been pretty bad. Yeah, right after it, coming out of the pass. Yeah. It was pretty bad. But the valley has been beautiful. We've just been running right along the pipeline. And uh, we're 150 miles out from the destination. So, getting, getting there and making progress. I'm in love with the clouds. Still got that 
awesome clouds.
great thing about this road is that unless you have a semi truck coming at you, you can drive in whatever lane you want. Wherever you want. Wherever you want. See, like right now, whoa, nope, we've got to come over this way. Too bumpy over there. Too bumpy over there. But then I can, I can come back over. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah. I'll come back over to my side. And it's okay for now, but there, see, I gotta maneuver over a little bit more. So you just start swaying back and forth, and then you end up in all kinds of lanes. That's fun. Lindsay calls it whack a mouse. Whack a mouse. Whack a mouse. I did. I did call it whack a mouse. She called it whack a mouse. But I meant whack a mole. Whack a mole. It's like we're trying to avoid all these things, and these holes, and these dips, and all this stuff. So we're like, we're going all over the place. Like I said, it's not whack a mole. It's kind of like it. It's kind of a void of, a void of whack a mole. <laughs> but you're not whacking the mole. No. It's don't whack a mole. Like mine. Mine feel. Yeah. So we're going to put together a, a blog post that'll probably be out there a long time before this video makes it. <laughs> Is this video gonna make it? I don't know. I we're, hope so. I don't know either. We're gonna we're gonna try to put this video together. But uh, that's gonna be one of the, one of the things that drive in the road is pick your lane, any lane. Just don't get hit by a semi truck. Did we tell you yet that the weather is going to be atrocious starting uh, Sunday? Saturday? Like really? we, yeah, the wind, the wind's gonna be bad tomorrow afternoon, and that's bringing all this crap in. And then they've got like two weeks the of gonna be bad when we're out freezing the cold. Oh yeah, yeah, it's supposed to be 20 to 30 mile an hour winds. That's nothing though. I mean, we have we're, we're used to hurricanes. Yeah, well, it's supposed to be uh, 3:30. Maybe we'll get 60 degrees. It's supposed to be a high of 60 tomorrow. But I don't know what the water temperature's like. I may polar plunge, because, I mean, that's about as polar plunge as you get, right? It's not the, these fake go swim in a pool on New Year's Day. Like, this is like swimming in the Arctic Ocean. You know what swims in the Arctic Ocean? Whales. And polar bears. Polar bears? Polar bears. Polar bears? You might see polar bears? No, we're not seeing polar bears. Polar bears are floating around on little chunks of ice right now because of global warming or whatever. Poor polar bears. Poor polar bears. We're headed into the town, if you will, of Dead Horse. It's, uh, one way in, one way out. This is the way in. The road has changed from rock to dirt. It's about to turn into washboard. Unless I wet it down this morning. Unless I wet it down this morning. I don't imagine there are very many permanent residents. A lot of people just come in and do their work. Ice out there. Yep. In a quarter mile, turn right onto the DS12 access road. Everybody out here in the oil fields drives a big truck. I don't see any Priuses, do you, Lindsay? No. No Priuses? No. I don't imagine they handle the Dalton Highway very well.
it is not your cute, quaint Alaskan small town. People pretty much come here for two reasons. One, to work in oil, and two, to be a tourist. Go for a dip in the Arctic, or at least go see it. Here we are, Prudhoe Bay General Store, which has the landmark sign that everybody comes to. The end of the Dalton Highway. Dead horse. Lindsay doesn't like the dead horse. But we made it. Time to go swim in the Mile Arctic. Mile zero. <laughs> Mile zero.